Um, I need a phone number and uh, an attorney. Your name's Alexis Davis. Oh, God. I told you I'd be fine. Do you still need Benny? I never did. How'd you Why? Know? I was never in custody. Uh, Taggart was just throwing his weight around. Max asked me a few questions about Luke. I don't uh, care about Luke. You, <laughs> you're overreacting, and you know what? You shouldn't do that because Michael picks up on your mood. If I'm telling he you, said telling he, you, he said you're running your way to prison. Who, Taggart? AJ. When? Wait, what are you I, talking I, about? In the docks, I ran into him right after you, you took off. He swears he's going to get Michael at any cost, and I can't wait anymore, Sonny. You got to kill him now. Forget about AJ. Why is he? Listen to me. You don't no, understand okay. what you're asking. You know, I know, I know, you know. I know. Look, you move too fast. They immediately assume that it's you. But, Sonny, I know how smart you are, and I know you can make him disappear, and nobody will know. I know that you can, and whatever you need for me to do to help you, I will. Yeah, and then, and then one day that boy, he asked you if you murdered his father. What are you going to do, lie to your son? Huh? Tell me, what are you going to do? Okay, what? You, know, you don't want me to be part of it? I don't, that's fine. But don't wait. You do this thing. I'm not going to kill AJ for the same reason. You can't. I will not set off a time bomb to explode in Michael's head. You hear what I'm saying? The damage we would do to that boy is not worth any revenge. I don't want him to look at us one day and see his father's killers. Father. Father of record. Okay, let me explain something to you. If I have to rip his arms out of the sockets and beat him with the bloody end, he's not going to get his hands on my kid. Carly, come here for a second. Sit down. Sit down. That little boy is going to grow up one day, want to meet his old man. Over my dead body. Like it or not, he's going to want some answers, and he's not going to accept them from you. Kids want to know where they came from. You should know, of all people. Michael needs AJ like typhus. Well, no argument there. But at some point, when Michael's eye level, he, he's going to have to find out for himself. He's going to go looking for his biological father, and he's going to find a hopeless excuse as a man. And that may hurt, but not half as much as a possible homicide. The, the grapevine will connect with his mother. Well, you he, why what didn't saying? you let me prosecute him then? Because it would have been your word against AJ's, and they would have ripped you to shreds. They'd have gotten you on that stand and made it look like it was your fault. AJ would have gotten off. Would have been the end. That's fine. You know what I want then? Hmm. I want him in jail for arson. Oh, okay. I, oh, I so... want you to put him in jail for arson. Right, right. And then, and then AJ's got the sob story of all time. Hey, 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 Michael. Uh, y your mother convinced Uncle Sonny to frame me and ruin my AJ life. AJ killed our son, Shh. Sonny. Keep what are you? What are you saying? Down. That he should just walk away. He should just get away. Like when he mangled. Jason, and he walked away from, like, he walks away from everything. Where's he gonna walk to, Carly? The same, the same uh, hell he's walking to now? He's, he's, gonna, he's gonna walk on his hands and knees pretty soon. We don't have to touch him. That's, He'll destroy that's himself. That's not enough, Sonny. What? That's not even nearly enough. Not now, but if you wait a little while, so when AJ looks at the man you raise from the gutter and sees disgust in his eyes, then the payback that you want so bad will start kicking in. You know, it's funny. You say that there's no little Catholic schoolboy in you. No residual training from the nuns. Vengeance is mine, saith the Lord. In the end, all the bad guys go to hell, right? Yeah, he's making his own hell. He's digging it deeper. You don't need to go there with him. You got your own little piece of heaven upstairs. For Michael's sake, forget AJ. He'll pay for our baby and everything else. Every right day of his life. Now, can you do me a favor? 
can you get AJ out of your head? Do my best. Thank you. Sure. <sighs> now, you're tired. Let me make you some lunch. I'm not hungry. Well, you will eat as a favor to Michael and me. Thanks for reminding me to eat. You can count on me for that. You can count on me to open your mail. If my name's on the address. We got an invitation to the nurse's ball. Um, I, you know what? I bought a table four months ago. I gotta call Lucy. What are you gonna call Lucy for? Well, I, I meant the table looks bad for the cars. I just told her to give it away. No, you know? don't keep the table away. I wanna go to the ball. Put him to sleep? Yeah. Eventually. He asked for you like three times. Why don't you tell me? I'd have come up. Because it was just a power play. I know it when I see it, you know? It's like, how far will Mommy and Uncle Sonny jump? You don't have to go up to him every time he takes a nap, you know? I just want him to know that I'm here if he needs me. He knows that you're here. There's a really fine line with kids between spoiling them rotten and loving them. Oh, so now you're Mrs. Disciplinarian? No. I'm almost as bad as you are. Did you call Lucy? Not yet. Good. I've been thinking about this, you know. Hmm. I haven't wanted to go anywhere, you know? I haven't wanted to leave Michael. I haven't wanted to go out in public. And when I saw that invitation, I wanted to go. I think that's a good thing, you know? It's been like this dark, gray, nothing, flat in my head for so long, and I, I don't know, it feels really good to finally have something I'm looking forward to. Well, that's great, you're feeling better, you know, we gotta keep that up. No, then we should go. Come on, it's been like 20 years, they haven't been able to go out as a couple together, that's huge. And I, I think that you owe it to Stone anyway, because you dedicated that whole GH AIDS wing in his name, and I wanna sit next to you. I want everybody to know what a good person you are. I don't give a damn what people think of me. I don't want to be sitting there, you know, all smiles like I'm enjoying myself. The only thing that Nurse's Ball does is remind me of everybody who's gone. <sighs> all right. I understand, and I don't mean to push you if you don't want to go. I'll go by myself. Absolutely not. You know what? I don't want to be a jerk about this, all right? But I don't, I, I don't, I don't want you going to the nurse ball. Quartermains are going to be there, including AJ. Why would you want to go? I don't know. I just. I want to, you know? I feel like it's something I need to do. I feel like I need to start over, you know? I need to finish things. That'll make me feel better, you know? I know it will. I just, I just really. Okay. You go with me? I feel to make you feel better. That's what you want. Yeah. Thank you. Tony, this will be good for us. You're gonna see. Okay. Where are you going? Stores are still open. I'm gonna see if I can get myself a dress. This is for the best. <laughs> 